We got a big one on the ice tonight, and along with Ray Ferraro, I'm James Sabalski, ready to call all the action. Two teams that play really smart hockey set to go at it tonight, Ray. It doesn't take much to get yourself into trouble. A couple of penalties, a poor penalty kill, and you run yourself in the danger. Both teams really pride themselves on how well they play the game. Enough talk, enough hype. Let's do this. Your first period is set to go. The Assassins take possession here on the opening draw, and we are underway. Great pass from the left wing up the middle now. Takes the return feed. Enters the offensive zone from the left. Sends it over. His presence known on the ice. The Assassins will play it from the defensive zone. Quick feed to Perlini. Pumps the puck away. Grabs it in his own end. The Falcons get a hold of the puck along the boards. Brampton's got control of it now from their own end. With some open space at center. As a first-year player, you dream about your first goal. He doesn't have it yet, but he's got the puck in the offensive zone here. Beautiful saucer pass. Pokes it away here in the neutral zone. Reads the play and forces the turnover. Here's a chance right out front. He scores! Always oh, good to get on the board. Get the monkey off your back early. Man, he laid a beauty of a pass across there. Enough air to clear the sticks, and it lands perfectly on the shooter's stick. The Falcons take the comfortable position of playing with the lead here, Ray. In the middle chunk of the period, you're looking for momentum to go one way or the other. They've got it now. Falcons Looks to get the puck over to Yurko. Here's a chance up front, knocked away. Picked up along the wall by Perry. Hammers it on net, makes the save on the slapper. More than half the period left to play. We've got a one nothing hockey game thus far. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. There's the whistle, penalty coming up. He's going off for tripping, and doesn't everybody feel like they're innocent on a trip? You feel like you're innocent on most every penalty, but this one always feels like it. It's a double iron shot! And pokes the puck loose inside the offensive end. Great pressure forcing the turnover! He scores! What a goal! That's surprising so quickly. They've scored two goals in just about a minute 20. That sure changes things here on the ice. Yeah, the game has completely been turned upside down. Play set to resume with the face-off ready to go. Puck is shot and play resumes. And a stick in the lane ends that threat. Scoops up the puck now. Dishes it to the toe. Reads the pass perfectly and takes it off. Crampton's been in the right position all game long. They've intercepted plays like this since the beginning. Toronto's got a hold of it along the wall. Toe. Unloads one. That eyes him on the play. Brampton's got the puck now. Hammers him in the open ice. Brampton's moving it into the offensive end. Kind of lost control. He scores. What a little puck luck on the play. Brampton's got one back. Lots of offensive fireworks so far. Yeah, this is great. I love goals, James. You know that. So yeah. it looks like there's lots of goals on the docket tonight. And they take possession. Nice job tangling him up on the draw. Nice zone entry on the left side. And it's a quick pass to Brower. Oh, but he tracks it perfectly in the offensive end. They've got the defense outnumbered. Sends it across. Denies him on the one-timer. Oh, what reaction. Brampton's got it in their own zone. Oh, he'd like to have that pass back. Fails to find the open man. Back to the point it goes. Turns it aside. Jacobs from the back end. Stops him with a glove. Hey, usually the whistle is going to stop the play. 
I guess not tonight. Martin's and here we go. Sends him down to the ice. That's a clear decision there. This is always the danger in a fight. You get into it, and if you get tagged, it's going to hurt. He looks like he's really struggling here. I think they found the tooth that was lost, and both teams now back inside the faceoff circle. Off the draw, and a nice job locking up his opponent. Gains the zone through the middle. The Falcons have it from their own end. Here they are on the attack. Takes a shot, and he makes the save. The Falcons have had way more chances offensively, and as a result, they're leading in this one. The Assassins take possession off the faceoff. Pumps it away to stay on the attack. And couldn't find the intended receiver on that one. Through center along the wing. Carries it in. Deflected away. Nice defensive use of the stick there. Scoops up the puck here. Moves it quickly over to Perlini. And he gains the zone here. Brampton's got the puck. Nice zone entry from the middle. From the point, they take control of it. Picks up the puck in his own end. Moves it to Perlini. Nice zone entry from the left. Set it out in front. He scores! Oh, a slick one-timer. Buries it. this first period. And play resumes as the puck is dropped. Scored by number 21. Can't keep a hold of it after that hit. Toronto's moving it up the ice. And by number 35. Throws it on going. Oh, what a great stop as he got a piece of it with the glove. Hangs on to the puck. First period almost in the books here, nearing the final 60 seconds. Brampton's got it into the offensive zone. Toronto's gained possession along the boards. Couldn't complete the play. Here's a shot, and that was stopped. Aaron pass, and the play's broken up. And there's the save. Horn sounds bringing an end to what has been a pretty fun start to this one. Official has made his way back to center rice, and we are ready to go for period number two. Well, after an intriguing opening period, here we go. It's period number two. Puck is dropped, and we are underway. Well, we've got over 20 minutes played thus far. Ray, how have you seen things? Toronto's had almost a dream start. You want to play the game almost entirely in the other end of the ice if you can. They've done that. Look at the shots and the two-goal lead. Answered the call there. Still plenty of time left in this frame. Toronto's been the better team here over the last few minutes, increasing their lead to two. Offense is on face off, and he wins the draw. And that goes off a player. And not much on that one. Brampton's got it in their own zone. Moves the puck. The Assassins played along the boards. Right up front! Scores! There it is, Ray! Uh, part of realizing the dream. Once you've played your first game, now you want to score a goal, and he's done both. This place and this bench still buzzing about what we just saw here. Uh, everybody is so excited when somebody gets their first goal. You always remember yours. This kid will never forget a goal. Quick feed to Perry. Moves into the slot! And that one's turned away. 
Colorado's been the more aggressive team offensively, and they continue to lead here in the second. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Off target! Now he's going to have to adjust the sights on that one. That thing's off target by a long way. Toughest part now is you still have to play. He scored his first NHL goal a little bit earlier, but you're so excited. Your head's going in a hundred different directions, but the game's still there to play. Takes the pass. Strong defensive effort. Toronto's got the puck against the half wall. And that's blocked. Crampton's got a hold of the puck. Smart defensive play there. Oh, what a stop! Puck battle along the boards. Good use of the body on the play. From the opposite point. Oh, and head hunting there. I think he did. Man, that thing is way over top of the net. Played big in the moment there. Looking to set up offensively. Toronto's got the puck along the wall. Big time play right there. One on one with the goaltender. Oh, what a stop on the breakaway. Good speed to break ahead of the pack. He thinks he's got the goalie beat, but shut down. That's a great stop. Toronto's got a hold of it against the wall. Wills covers it up for a whistle. Is there a strategy here? Sometimes, or he just reads the play in front of him and says, now nah, I got to jump on this. We're going to start to run around. Buck is dropped, and we are back underway. Along the right side into the offensive zone. Fires it! Big time stop there. Great reflexes, another save. That's in a dangerous spot. He makes a good save here. Regains possession at center. Slides it across. Turns it away. He scores! There it is! The rookie with his... and his teammates as they realize he's got his first. Toronto's won the draw in the neutral zone. And as he stumbles, he coughs up the puck. Hill's taking it from his own end. Moves the puck inside the offensive zone. Takes a shot. Scores! The deadlock's broken. That's a... Thank their goaltender for a lot of this. He's kept them close, and now they've worked themselves into a position to be in front. Just wide. Here's a chance. Stones up with the blocker. 12 minutes, 46 seconds. Toronto's been the busier team offensively with way more shots on goal, but they still trail in the second. Brampton's got it in the defensive zone. Trying to get back on the attack now. Here he is from the slot. Way too much congestion blocks that. Brampton's in now. Here's a chance. Right in the slot. Gives them nothing in front. Late goings of this period. Brampton's got the momentum with a one goal lead. They'd love to add to that. The Falcons win the draw. Here's a short pass to Gravner. Streaking into the attacking zone from the right. Too much congestion blocks the shot. From the boards, he takes that pass. Swing and a miss. They go on the attack through center. Moves the puck to the attacking area. The assassin scoop it up along the boards. Handles the puck. Gaining momentum along the wing. Toronto's got possession here in the neutral zone. There's the whistle from the linesman calling it offside. I don't know that you dream about scoring a hat trick in your first year. First, you just want to get to the league. Then you want to score. Now you got a chance for this. Toronto's won it. Quick pass to Brower. On the doorstep. Scores! They've been clawing away at this lead, James. Trying to get this game back even. And there's the goal that does it. The Falcons have answered back in a big way here late in the second. 
They really pushed themselves back into this game, trailing by one. They worked their way back to a tie game. Oh, that's going to be a penalty. They're going to have to call that. The Assassins will serve two for slashing. That's a bad reaction. He's beaten. He's out of position. He just turns around and whacks him. Just a good old-fashioned hack. And they get the puck out of harm's way. Second frame almost done. Well inside a minute now. From the left side into the middle of the neutral zone. Turns the puck over. Great read defensively there. Toronto's looking to break out of their own end. It's a two-on-one to his teammate and makes the save. Just here in the late stages of this frame, you can feel the energy in this crowd. It's a tie game. The Falcons win it. Rips it on net, shuts them down. Brampton's got the puck along the boards. Back at the point, they set it up. And a great save. Darling's job is not just to stop the puck, but get it out of danger. He does that here. And they'll get it out of the defensive end. Toronto's got it from behind the net. Moves it quickly over to Martin. Feeds it to Brower. Couldn't find the intended target. Still anyone's game, especially the way these two teams have been producing offensively as the second period comes to an end. Hey fans, great ticket. Opening face off for period number three is ready to go. Man advantage is still intact as this period gets underway and they win the draw. And that slides right out to center ice. There's the whistle and this power play will come to an end as another man's off to the box. He gets burned for playing the puck outside the trapezoid. Sometimes they think the puck's going to roll in there and then they get caught, stuck. No, did, he he ever, did he ever? Do you like this call? No. Well, I like the call because it's the rule, but I don't like the trapezoid. Manages to hang on. A chance. They score. Ray, I don't know how many times we travel around. You always talk about it's better to play in front. Well, you break the deadlock here, James. Now you get out in front. You can dictate the pace of the game. Ha! Huh. Better to be lucky than good. This thing bounces around and somehow evades the goaltender. I don't even really know how that ended up in the net. The Falcons have jumped out to a one-goal lead here in this... Th Uh, pretty clear this game's not going to spread out at all. Two very equal teams battling it out. Slides it on over to Perlini. Here's a chance on the doorstep. Can connect. Just slide to the net. And by number 35, Passed up ahead. Sharp breakout pass there. The Assassins. Penalty has expired. They now go to work on the power play. Centered out in front. He scores. There it is. The freshman with his first. All right, the rookie's still excited about his first goal. Where does that, what's the process with the puck? Trainer throws some tape on it. They give it to the PR department. They put together a, a nice little memento and it goes on your wall. When I played, it ended up in a puck bucket somewhere. Time to change. And they can't connect. Trying to get something going here with this man advantage as they start from their own end. Time of the goal, 55 seconds. Toronto's got possession while undermanned. And that's just out of reach. Chase right in front. Comes up on the blocker save. That goes wide. Grabs the puck here inside the offensive end. A chance. Stopped by the goaltender. 
I remember sitting on the bench when I got my first NHL goal in the Montreal form. I could barely sit still. I was so excited. I'm sure he feels the same way. Uh, you can just see he's trying to keep the poker face going here, Ray. Takes the puck as the clock ticks down on the penalty kill. Gets it out of his own end. Takes the feed from the goaltender. He got all of that one. Puck knocked loose in the neutral zone. Puts it on goal, and that carries right off the mask. Well, whatever you got to do, I guess, man, those guys are lucky the masks are as good as they are now. Into the offensive zone. Into the attacking area from the left side. From the slot, fantastic save! Right from the most dangerous area on the ice, the goalie flashes the glove. That's an arrogant stop. Toronto's turned good defense into good offense as they lead it early in this third period. Sends the pass over. And that skips away on a nice defensive deflection. Here's a shot. Save made by the goalie. Yeah, he's pretty good positioning here, James. He makes the two stops back to back. Toronto's got the puck against the boards. Stopped by the goaltender. Darling's going to hang on and just let things settle down for a moment. He really didn't have many options to play the puck, but no. in a close game, you want to be sure every time you do. The frozen biscuits dropped, and we are back underway here. Brampton's got it along the wall. Here's a shot. Big chest save as he gobbled that one up with the trapper. Perry's got it along the boards. And that one's broken up by a great defensive play. The Falcons have the puck now. With possession along the wall. And that's out of reach and out of the offensive zone. Nice stick work to knock the puck loose. Takes it into the slot. And he blocks the shot. Great defensive play. He grabs the puck here at the point. On the doorstep, makes the save. Moves it to toe. Takes it across the blue line. And he totally whiffs on that one. Great heads up play in the defensive zone. Nice poke check. And that pass goes awry. The Falcons gain control of the puck against the wall. Unable to reach that one. And he uses his reach to disrupt the play. Offside the call, and we'll have a face-off just outside the blue line. The Sabres are up next as this road trip continues. Yeah, there's never an easy night on the road. You think that you're playing well, and then you go into somebody else's building. They're waiting for you. Taken by Hill. Brampton's got the puck in the defensive end. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Gets the full use of his stick on the poke check. The Assassins have it behind the net. Toronto's got a hold of it along the wall. And a nice poke check inside the neutral zone. Hammered into the boards. Wow, he closed off his room, slammed them into the boards. They're still rattling. Passes on over to Dauphin. Right out in front, and he can't get it off. And the lane's clogged up, blocking that. The Assassins take it across the line. Take it along the wall by Martin. And now he tries to get it across to Brower. That pass goes a little sideways. Takes the feed. Dumps it in. Toronto's gained possession along the boards. Here they come. Quick feed to Brower. Here's an odd man rush. Hammers one and puts it high. Our goalie had to dock that thing was so high. Levels him against the wall. Puck moved over to Yurko. Dauphin's got it along the wing. Takes a shot. Comes up with the stop. Darling's got the puck, and he'll hang on. Another whistle. Well, in a close game, you've got to be in control of things, and he's had an excellent night so far. Toronto's offense, the story tonight as they lead it here in this third period. Brampton's won the draw. Grabs the puck. They've got numbers. It's a two-on-one. Excellent stick work on the play. Here he is shot right in front. Dismissed that chance. Oh, and another big stop. 
in tight. He had to make an excellent save. Pokes it away to keep the pressure on. Here's a chance, a two-on-one. And that's broken up with a stick in front. Takes the feed. Less than a minute to go now here in regulation. With the stop. The Assassins move the puck in the defensive zone. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. Strong defensive effort. The sense of urgency has really set in. They pulled the goalie. The extra attacker's out. Perlini's swooping in on the attack. A chance to end it. Can't get it to go. Brampton's got the puck along the wall. Nice pass. Knocks the puck away in the open ice. The Assassins have it now. Gains the zone through center. Along the boards, they battle for the puck back and forth. And a heads-up kick pass over to his teammate. No one home on that play. And the puck leaves the zone going back to center ice. And there's the final horn bringing this one to an end. The freshman sensation scores. The team wins. You didn't get that W when you scored your first goal, did you? No, I actually had four points, but I was on for four of their goals against, too. It's kind of a mixed bag that night. But you still remembered it. Oh, you bet. They're feeling good about this one, and here they come back out onto the ice, Razor. Unreal support from their fans. They salute them a thank you for their efforts tonight. On behalf of Ray Ferraro, I'm James Sabalski. Thanks for joining us. Good night.